The phones that you can get in North Korea, for example, work very differently than the phones you're used to. State-sanctioned phones from North Korean state-owned companies are the only ones that you can legally possess. They can't connect to the internet, and they can't make international phone calls outside of North Korea. Moreover, they have state-sanctioned software installed on them that cannot possibly be removed, and that disables all foreign files, apps, clips, and text or sound files that were not created on North Korea's own state-owned operating system, called Red Star. These North Korean phones will also continually and randomly take screenshots of messages and activity history that cannot possibly be deleted, and inspections of the phone are mandatory by the North Korean police. In essence, these phones are only usable within North Korea and can only be used in ways that the North Korean regime deems acceptable. But foreign-made phones from the outside world smuggled in across the northern border were always problematic to the Kim regime's desire for this truly closed-off digital state. Foreign-made phones could actually make calls to the outside world, and they could contain outside foreign-made files like videos, texts, and sound. They were big business for a few entrepreneurial smugglers, because using a foreign-made phone might be the only way that a family within North Korea could contact a relative of theirs who had attempted an escape previously. It might be the only way to have ever known if your relative was still alive or dead. Many North Korean families would thus save up enormous amounts of money to meet these smugglers for the chance at a phone call to the outside or a chance to view or read something from the outside but no longer. By slamming shut the border and increasing the harshness of its laws, the North Korean regime has probably destroyed this smuggling process that was undermining its closed digital state ambition once and for all. And as the risks for getting defectors out have increased, so have the prices that the brokers are charging to try and help.